Hey guys, what's up? So as the Halloween season gets closer, um, I realize I haven't really done anything in a long time. I really, really loved the Desi Perkins um, melting ice cream cone on her head. That was like freaking badass. Seriously, like amazing. But I didn't want to copy that. And then there was a couple other inspiration pictures like that is amazing. I don't know who that is, but that's freaking amazing. And I just was like, I want to do something I've never really seen uh, be done. And this could be quite the disaster, but I guess we'll find out. I just know I, know I want it to be like Fruit Loops and colorful and uh, just really cool. So let's jump right in and see what happens. So the first thing I'm going to reach for is my Anastasia Brow Wiz. And I believe this is in the color um, dark brown. And I'm just going to start filling in my brows. Then I'm going to take some of this NYX, um, what the heck is this called? White stick. <laughs> I can't remember the name of it. Um, oh yeah, jumbo pencil and milk. Sorry. And then I'm just going to start smoothing that all over my lid as my eyeshadow primer. Then I'm just going to reach for this Ben Nye Super White setting powder. And it's really, really messy. I got it all over my pants. And I'm going to just set everything we just did. And then, of course, I forgot about the lower section of my eye. So I'm just going to put the white stuff all over that too. And just set it and make sure it's ready to go for eyeshadow. Then I'm going to be reaching for the Morphe 35B palette. And I'm going to take this super pretty fuchsia color and I'm just gonna keep building that up on my lid until I'm happy with the coloring then I'm gonna take this darker purple shade and just do the same thing and just keep darkening up the color by adding more and more and more I love using this white NYX pencil because it makes bright colors just pop so I freaking love it and of course I'm on the phone here so I'm just going to be putting that um, reddish orange color in the corner there. And then I'm going to take some yellow for the inner corner, which actually turned out kind of orange on top of that red, which I really liked. And then I'm just going to blend out kind of the inner corner and the top. On the other eye, I'm going to be reaching for some blue. And I'm going to do the same thing I did with that other pink color I'm just gonna build that color up in my crease and then in the electric palette I'm gonna be taking um, a really pretty deep blue and just focus that in the outer corner then I'm gonna reach for this um, darker green and I'm gonna put that all over the rest of my lid um, this color was kind of hard to work with I had to put a lot on there just to get a good color payoff um, but I'm just gonna put that on there and then blend it out a little bit with my fluffy brush and then I'm gonna reach for that Urban Decay palette again and get that gorgeous mint green and I'm gonna put that in the tear duct area and this color is freaking gorgeous I was like I just wanted to keep filing it on it was so pretty and then I'm gonna take that yellow and I, I just decided that it wasn't light enough on the purple side and I was like I need yellow for this look because there's yellow fruit loops so I just popped some of that in the inner corner there and then I started doing the lower and I just pretty much copied what was up top I put the purple the red the orange and the yellow and then I just kind of smoothed it all out with my fluffy brush and did the other side and of course, I can't go about my day without some mascara. I put that on before I do my liner so that it can dry in time for my lashes. And next, I'm going to be using, um, I think it's the Iconic Black Liner number 77. And um, then I'm going to be taking that jumbo pencil again and lining my waterline just to make my eyes look a lot bigger. And I just love the way that white looks with a lot of color. And I'm just setting that with some powder so it doesn't get all greasy. 
And then of course, I'm just gonna top that off with some mascara on the lower lash line. Then I found my friend in the back room just chilling. So I was like, let's pop this baby on. I got my wig cap and I'm just gonna cover up all my hair because I obviously don't want my hair to show. Uh, um, so yeah, I'm going to pop this wig on. I got this wig down the street um, at a local store near me and it's freaking huge. It did not look as big as it is on the mannequin. And when I got home, I was like, I could never wear this in public. <laughs> it's like ridiculous looking. Um, but the color is really pretty. So I was like, okay, I can do this. And then of course, when my boyfriend's home, I'm always bugging him to get me something. <laughs> As you can see, he was like, no more. Um, but now I'm just going to brush this wig out because it made it look a thousand times better and classier, in my opinion. And then I'm just going to reach for my Fenty Beauty foundation. And I think I'm in the shade 190. Uh, don't quote me on that. And then I'm pinning this wig back because it was just out of control. And then I attempted to have my boyfriend help me put this box on top of my head. Um, but we had some technical difficulties. So um, I just moved on to other things and started putting a little contour on one side of my face. I finally got the box on there with a the bobby pin. And I was like, why didn't I think of that before? Then I'm going to take this Ben Nye white paint. And I'm just going to start drawing like drips of milk, if that makes sense of kind of what it would look like if somebody dumped a box of cereal on my head with milk in it. Um, this was a lot harder than it looked like. Um, and I wanted it to look, you know, as natural as possible, but it's hard when you're drawing them on your face. So I just continued trying to draw these all over my face. So as I go along, I'm just going to be drawing little drips from the other drips and just fill them in here and there as I go. And then I'm going to be taking some lipstick. This is from Anastasia Beverly Hills. This is my first matte lipstick from them. And I have to say the consistency was pretty nice. I'm not going to lie. And that color though. Yes. So then I'm just going to keep trying to draw. As you can see, I had to make... I made some mistakes, so I had to take some off here and there. Um, this actually, you know, took kind of a while because I did not know how to use this shit. I was like, what the? But I just kept trying to draw milk how I would think milk would be drawn. So. be taking some non-toxic white paint and this little dropper that I found in one of my other beauty tools and I was like oh my god what if I get paint and make it look like it's actually like 3d dripping but unfortunately this paint didn't really work out that way it was super duper thick and hard to work with um so this was like all trial and error um and then my wig kept getting in it and just everything but I guess it makes it look kind of sloppy in a way, which is good because I don't expect it to look clean. So yeah, I just kept continuing to try to drip the milk on my face with the paint. And of course this look wouldn't be complete without some Fruit Loops. And I used eyelash glue for this. It worked 
fantastically. It was like stuck on there. So I just sporadically placed these all over my face where I saw fit. And I love this part. I just love the color and it was so fun to do, seriously. And then I took a teasing comb and I teased the front part of this wig so that I could attempt to put a spoon in there and get it stuck, make it look like it fell into my hair. So this took a few times and, and then I just kept getting the hair in the paint and making it look worse, <laughs> but who cares? Um, yeah, so I eventually got the spoon in there. Okay guys, that's it. I had so much fun doing this tutorial. The only thing I'm really kind of bummed about is um, the thick paint at the end. I wanted it to just look like it was dripping off, but it was so thick. And I hope you guys liked this tutorial and I will list all the product blah, 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 details below as per the huge. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe.